Hi everyone. I don't know about you, but I often meet people and even after asking them what they do, I still have no idea what they actually do and what problems they solve for their clients. Now, obviously if I was in their niche, it might be more self-evident, but if they led with what problems they solved, I, you know, I might be able to determine if I or somebody I knew you know, would benefit from their service. So it's a bit like that ongoing joke in Friends where none of Chandler's friends know what his profession is. And just as a reminder, we'll watch a little clip from it. What is Chandler Bing's job? <laughs> oh gosh, this has something to do with numbers and processing. Well, yeah, and he carries a briefcase. 10 <laughs> seconds, you need this or you lose the game. <gasps> it's, um, it has something to do with transponding. Oh, 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 he's a trans transponster! <laughs> And the correct answer is Chandler is an IT procurement manager with specialization in statistical analysis and data reconfiguration. Now, if Chandler had led with what problems he solved for his clients, you know, he would have said, you know, something like this, you know, hi, I'm Chandler and I help companies make sense of the data they're collecting so they become even more profitable. So for example, you know, one of my clients is a large retailer and we were able to determine from the data they were collecting, when was the best time to approach previously sold customers for a repeat purchase? So by getting the timing exactly right, we were able to increase their profits by 10%. Now there's obviously a lot more to what I actually do, and I'd be happy if you have more time to tell you about it. Now regardless of whether we could ever remember what Chandler's job title was, we do now at least know that he helped companies become more profitable. Of course, all of this is just another version of an elevator pitch, and any salesperson worth their salt should always have one ready to go. One that doesn't primarily focus on ourselves, you know, our achievements, you know, the company or service that we represent, but rather the problems that we fix. Now, if this is something that you don't already have in your arsenal, you know, why not have some fun this week by seeing who in your team can create the best one? So there you are, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed the video. And as I always say, if you like the content I'm putting out there, you know, please go ahead, click the follow, give me a like, and as always, good selling.